Welcome back to The Colonel Does Grim Fandango Remastered, and we are at Rick's Cafe American <laughs> in Rubicava, and uh, it's one year later. And there is a lady waiting for us. I'm hoping it's Ms. Colomar. Let's see. Anything we can do here? Quite possibly. Ah, Lady Luck. Oh. Le numéro gagnant, le 31, noir, entre les passes, 31, black. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen, please place your, place your bets. bets. Mesdames et messieurs, okay. rien n'a pas plus. Les jeux sont faits. Ladies and gentlemen, betting is closed. Oh, no more bets, please. Le jeu noir par manque. Number two, two is the winner. Your chips, monsieur. Merci. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen, please place mm. your bets. Mesdames et messieurs, rien ne va plus. Les jeux sont faits. Ladies and gentlemen, betting is closed. All right, I don't know what's going on there. <clears throat> Anything else I can do? <clears throat> Can't. What if Meche makes her big arrival and I sleep through it? Meche. That is who I'm looking for. <clears throat> <laughs> what is that? Oh, yeah. Gladys on the piano. Play it again, Sam. <laughs> Hello, Manny. Hola. Oh, doing it in style. I love it. I can see why people loved this game back in the day. I mean, it's not the best game in the world, but the storyline and the characters are just absolutely awesome. Quiet night, huh, Cardinal? Day of the dead ain't good for business, Chief. But last night... Remember last night, Manny? Oh, wait! <laughs> What's that you're playing? Oh, this is just a little, you know, love song for a special lady. <laughs> Sing a little bit of that song, why don't you? Well, I only have this part. Bone wagon. I like it. You think she'll come in tonight? Who, my special lady? No, Meche. You know what, Manny? I think she will. I got a feeling tonight's the night. Oh, you're a good egg. You're a good egg, Gladys. You know, when we leave, I'm actually going to miss this place. Ah, oh, Manny, why can't we just stay here? We got our fancy club. We got three squares a day. Max lets me take the bone wagon out on his kitty track once a week. Plus, we look good in these clothes. Gladys, I can't live in this world forever. It's not where I belong. I've got to find Meche and help her. Because if it weren't for me, she'd have been on that train a year ago. Okay, Manny. Well... I'll let you get back to practicing. I don't need to practice, man. <laughs> I'm good. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> All right, where are we going here? <clears throat> Excuse me. Grab a drink. Ah, Marillo de Oro. A very fine liqueur filled with solid gold flakes. Yes, I better take this with me for safekeeping. <laughs> like Goldschlager? <laughs> well, maybe just a sip. There you go. Ah. Le numéro gagnant, le vin, noir, berry pass, 20, black. Uh oh. Am I drunk? Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen, please place your bets. I don't bets. really want to do that. Okay. Mesdames really et messieurs, rien ne va plus. Les jeux sont faits. Ladies and really gentlemen, betting is closed. No more I bets, really please. Do that. Maybe I need to put that away. Not while they're losing. 
Everything okay down here? I'm going to need some more chips if Monsieur Lucky does not call it a night soon. Everything okay down here? I'm going to... Who is Mr. Lucky? You know, some people say you should always walk away from the table when you're on a winning streak. Oh, yes, but I'm feeling extra lucky tonight. Hmm. I don't like that. Gold Schlager. That's it. Le numéro gagnant, le 22, noir. Mind if I sit down, Charlie? Of course not, Manny. I, I mean, it is your club, right? Right. So what are you doing in it? Didn't I tell you not to come back until you can pay your bar tab? Oh, <laughs> or they kicked me out of that cat trick for printing fake betting stubs. So now I have to come here, Manny, which I love, which I love. Oh, what was the name of that guy from the movie? And of course, I'm talking about Casablanca. Oh, it was the little mousy dude. Yes, Mr. Rick. <laughs> How did you print fake betting stubs? With this. Isn't she beautiful? The last time I was incarcerated, I shared a cell with the most dishonest con man I ever met. He was strictly small time, and I managed to steal this from him quite easily. Thanks. You never know when this may come in handy. Hey, give that back to me, Manny. Maybe once you sell your bar tab, hey, Charlie? Oh, Manny. <laughs> oh, Charlie. What a dumbass. Why would you bring a betting, the counterfeit betting thing, the prince, all that, whatever he just said, and put it on the table in front of the owner? What else can you counterfeit? Nothing. Anything. <laughs> So can you make passports? Manny, you still think like a living man in so many ways. No soul needs a passport. We are all citizens of the same nation, and our king rides a pale horse. So no passports? No. No, that little hologram is so tricky, you know? <laughs> How about driver's licenses? Sure. Just, um, give me a recent picture, 50 bucks in, uh, about two weeks, okay? When I think of something I need, I'll come back. I'm not a wishing well, Manny. Why aren't you over at the roulette tables? The roulette is for lonely widows and Frenchmen. Why don't you get some slot machines, Manny? Everybody, old women, little children, they all love slot machines. And I have a system, an infallible <laughs> system for beating them. I'll think about it. <laughs> I can tell when you're just humoring me, you know? I think slot machines attract an undesirable element. Oh, well, we're all undesirable, Manny. Yeah, but your credit's no good to boot. <laughs> uh... Tell me your system, Charlie. I can't tell you my secrets. Uh, just this. You have to become one with the bandit, Manny. You you have to get inside the machine and, and make it one to pay. On second thought, stay away from my roulette tables. <laughs> All my friends are lonely widows and Frenchmen. Except me, Manny. I'm here to keep you sane. That's a nice suit. Where'd you steal it? Manny... If you learn to play the odds like Chow Chila Charlie, then maybe you too can have a suit this fine someday. Well, I've got a club to run, so... Oh, yes. Please, Manny. Get on with your glamorous life. I will. All right, so... Le numero gagnant, le quinze. I wonder if that's what I need to do. Let's use this. Mesdames and messieurs, ladies and gentlemen, gold mine to please place your beds. Oh, so maybe I can use that upstairs. Alright. So I think I want to go to the coat check room, because that's... No. Go, go, go. I saw... 
That's what I saw. Put that away. No! Evening, Lupe. Hi, Manny. <laughs> I have to tell you about my new organizational system for the coats. <laughs> <laughs> Think she'll come in tonight? Manny, you ask me that every night. What am I supposed to say? You're supposed to say, yes, I think tonight's the night. <laughs> yes, I think tonight's the night. That you finally go nuts from waiting for the grand entrance of Ms. Mercedes Colomar. Wait, 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 wait. <clears throat> I thought you said that there was somebody waiting. Let's try that again, or shall we? Humoring us. Think she'll come in tonight? Yes! I think tonight's definitely the night. Thank you. <laughs> it's my fault she's out in the woods alone, you know. <sighs> if you say so, Manny. Oh, I like her, too. How's the flow tonight? We're dead tonight, Manny. Everybody's back home for the Day of the Dead, I guess. Except for the casino. The casino's hopping. Why is it that all the people who don't go home are the same people who just love to gamble? Well, I guess when you've got nothing to go home to, you've got nothing to lose. Hey, we should put that over the door. <laughs> Everything okay back in the land of fur and fedoras? Everything's in order. It's beautiful. I can't wait for people to come in and try the new system. It's so cool. Want to hear about it? Yeah, tell me about okay. it. Okay, tell me all the details about your new coat check system. Yay! Okay, I found all these plastic tiles in the back, left over from the automat, and guess what? What? They all have numbers on them. So what I'm doing is, I give one to everyone who checks a code in and... Manny, you're not even listening to me. I go to all this work <laughs> organizing your coats and you don't even care. Lupe. Forget it. Don't pretend to care. No, I want to hear. Hup. Oh, I'll tell someone else about <laughs> it. Someone who cares. Please, tell me all about your new coat check system, really. Don't patronize me, Cal. Okay, back to work. Okay. <laughs> Damn, I like what he's done with the place. All right, so... Oh, hello, lady. Mechie? Manny, help me. I've been lost for so long. Why didn't you look for me? That's I did. Her. You ran off. Why? Because you said I was no good. I've been all alone in the world for a whole year. And it's all because of you! Whoa! What? Number nine? Is that Thomas? just happened this gonna be an annual thing with you Manny every day of the dead you toss your bones into the drink and I fish them out I don't plan to be around that long Velasco as soon as I find out where that ocean liner's going I'm after it ha oh, oh. ha that ship's going to Puerto Zapato that's the other side of the world there ain't no ships going out that way but the old limbo here but but nothing if the limbo's my only hope then I'm already on board uh, well good luck son that's all I got to say here, let me help you with that. Ah, there's some things a man's got to do for himself. All right. Ooh, it's spooky down here. <laughs> some might say. <clears throat> Is there nowhere I can get in there? Is there anything over this way? I guess not. 
What's over here? It's locked, but there's nothing up there anyway. This gate only leads up to the Lombada dock, and the Lombada's gone. I've got the lumps to prove it. Okay. So, what's over here? There it is. Max's giant cat racetrack. How's a regular guy with three roulette tables supposed to compete with that? What is down here? Why are you looking around? Or is this the LSA or LHA or whatever it is? <laughs> is that a tattoo? <laughs> Looks like it hurts. Hola, Toro. ¿Cómo estás? Uh, not now, Manny. I'm in the middle of something with Naranya here. <laughs> Hello, operator? Yeah, it's me, baby. How'd you know? Hey, don't say that, sweetheart. You know I meant to stop by and... I'm more happy about leaving town every minute. Who was that that he was talking to? I told you, Calavera, no. It's empty. Yeah, I got to remember to get more liquid nitrogen from Morg. Liquid nitrogen? Freeze the bones, less painful that way. Hey, that sounds good. I could go for that. You've got plenty of painkiller in that bottle of yours, so shut up and hold still. I want, maybe that's what I need the bottle for. Okay. Anything back here? No. Anything over here? No. It's empty. I really doubt I'll be touching that any time soon. Oh, yeah, that's kind of nasty. Hey! Shut door! You slow down my grinder. Very painful. Very painful, eh, Naranja? Like torture. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So... I'm guessing that we're going to have to get a tattoo at some point, but... I don't think that point is now. So let's go back up. Uh, there was another... W Actually, there was a lift. That I saw. Right there. Oh, hello. You know... I'm kind of getting lost. What? What is going on over here? Ugh, I'm not sure what I hate more, crowds or cats, but I'm definitely not going near either one today. Most time, no more bets. Oh, 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 oh. So maybe we need to find out who won. I'm keeping this little gold mine to myself. Put it away, put it away, put it away. They don't have much use when they're alive, and stuff, they don't have much more. <laughs> Anything over this way? No? No? Fuchi, that smell is peor que la muerte. Okay, whatever that I means. could open it with my teeth, but I'm not that hungry. I that? could open it with my teeth, but I'm not that hungry. What am I supposed to do here? Tempting as it is, 
I just can't bring myself to jump in the giant unclean kitty litter. Oh, that's disgusting. Is that what that is? Alright, so I don't know what's supposed to happen here. Okay, so I guess we go up the stairs. Losing ground. Hey! Catching up! Desdemona. Looks like Edward a great Price. night for cat races. In second, In second place, place, Rusty, Rusty Anchor, Anchor. Desdemona. Desdemona, coming around the bend. Drooling Monkey, bringing up the rear. <laughs> Drooling Monkey, oh no, she's gone down. Bum Bum's Hope, she's getting up, licking herself off. <laughs> One more lap. What a race! Desdemona, Rusty Anchor, could go either way. Rusty Anchor, right on the heels of Desdemona. Okay. Gaining ground, badass Bella. <laughs> Desdemona, coming into the home stretch. Okay. It's Desdemona, and then Rusty Anchor, followed by Badass Bella, Desdemona, in the lead. Come on, finish the race. Rusty Anchor, closing in. And Badass Bella. Desdemona, standing her ground. Desdemona, coming up on the finish. We have a winner. Desdemona, in first, followed by Rusty Anchor, and in third place, Badass Bella. Desdemona, Rusty Anchor, and Badass Bella. And again, the winner. Desdemona, followed by Rusty Anchor, Badass Bella. You're not my paw. Chow down, Charlie. Bum Bum's home. So maybe I need I need to know what the date is. Oh, what's up here? What? Good God! How big is this freaking place? Oh, better put that away. Busy night? Hardly. Everybody's gone home for the holiday already. This place is dead, and I'm bored, Manny. Bored. What's the shuttle waiting for? Oh, uh, they're just cleaning it, but they're very thorough. We run a tight ship here, you know. Can I try out your metal detector? What's your sudden interest in metal detectors, Manny? I'm just a collector. Well, I'll show it to you when I'm on break. How's that? <laughs> When's your break? Dawn. Oh, that's too late. I'm shipping out tonight. Yeah, right. I've fallen for that line too many times. <laughs> I think it's time for your break. We could slip in the back for a little drink. You can tell me all about your job, the danger, the metal detectors. That back room's all business, Manny. And so am I. What kind of business goes on back there, Carla? Strip searches. Hmm, and you don't qualify. <laughs> Why don't I qualify for a strip search? Manny, I agree it would help pass the time, but we have procedures and rules here. And you never know when they're watching. I can only strip search people when a regular search turns up nothing. Hey, it's worth a try. Ooh, I love this part. <laughs> Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings on the security desk. Uh-oh. Oh, you're clean. Rats, Manny. I almost got to strip search you. Huh. So maybe I need to get something so that she can strip search me. Which just seems wrong on so many levels. They're locked. They're lockers. 
<laughs> Alright, I think this is a good place to end this episode. If you have any comments or suggestions, please feel free to leave them below. And until next episode, please do take care.